What's going on, you guys? It's Jamel, man. Back again with another video. Um, John Wick 4 review. You see the title? You see the, thumb see the thumbnail? So let's get straight into it, man. John Wick 4 is impeccable, bro. It's astonishing, bro. It's, it's oh my God, bro. It's oh my God, bro. This, this movie is the contender of the movie for movie of the decade. Best action movie of the decade. It is in running contention for sure. Um, sorry, this is my dog King. Um, he's interrupting my video. Um, but uh, bruh, this movie is amazing. Um, I need my thumbnail, King. You gotta, you gotta move, you gotta move out the way. Uh, this movie is amazing, impeccable. This is the Avengers Endgame of John Wick, bruh. This is the Avengers Endgame. With like John Wick is Thanos and he has like all the Infinity Stones, but he doesn't win or lose, bro. This is this is this is like oh my god. Without the team ups, without the amazing team up, this is this is Avengers Endgame. So let's talk about the characters um and stuff like that. Um, so we got Bill Skarsgård, which if you guys don't know is Pennywise. Um, we got Lawrence Fishburne, obviously, which is um neo not neo um i don't know he's somebody in the, in the matrix um not too familiar with the matrix franchise uh but it's like the camaraderie is already there with the with the acting with the with the relationship is already there the camaraderie is already there because they, they already acted together in another franchise so that's what i'm saying um we got bill skarsgård we got uh lawrence fishburne we got keanu reeves obviously um and this new character Kane is very good. Let's talk about the new character. So we got this new character Kane. Um, he's very entertaining. He's very cool. Um, yeah, and like a couple other new characters. You know what I'm saying? Other villains and stuff. Um, let's talk about the runtime. Um, two hour and forty two minutes, if I'm not mistaken. Two. Okay, so let's just say two and a half hour runtime, basically. Um. Not bad. I mean, it flies by because the action is constant. It, it hooks you in as soon as you watch the movie. So it's like, it's not like a drag. It doesn't feel like a chore to watch. You know what I'm saying? I definitely have not been in the mood to watch shit. Like, if it feels like a chore, you know what I'm saying? It was like, I don't want to watch it. I'm not going to watch it type shit. Like, if it feels like, oh my God, like. Do I really want to watch this right now? Like, I'm not finna watch it that I'm questioning to watch. But yeah, like I said, this movie is impeccable, bro. Like I said, bro, it's, it's, it's in running contention for movie of the decade, for sure. I have to see it again. Um, just think about this. This all started with a dog, bro. This all started with a dog, and I got a dog right here. Nigga, kill my dog, I'm gonna turn into John Wick. You know what I'm saying? That's the nah, but uh, and like the ending, the ending is gonna be what is that called? It's gonna be like a lot of, a lot of uh, split tension on the ending. What is the word I'm looking for? It's gonna be a lot of debates about the ending, bro. A lot of people are gonna like it, and a lot of people are gonna hate it. It's gonna be uh, what is that called? Like a, it's gonna be a spectrum for sure. People that love the ending and hate the ending. Me personally, I don't know. I don't fucking know. I'm kind of like, uh, kind of like, mm, what the fuck, mmm. Listen, I don't like it. I don't. I don't like the ending, bro. Spoiler coming this way. Listen, this will be a spoiler for John Wick Four. So if you've not seen the movie, exit off this video right now because I'm gonna move into spoilers right now. Look. Uh, my sentiment is. John Wick went through all my camera died. Um, so like, like I was in, look, 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 this is spoilers. This is my sentiment about the end. And I'm going to give it to you raw. 
John Wick went through all this for four movies. One, two, three, four. I don't know if this is a hot take. To get killed by a blind man? Come on, bruh. To die from a blind man? And I know they was having a, like a Western standoff. But to get killed by a blind man? So you telling me all these people he killed and this is how he dies. This is his fate. To die by a blind man. That just doesn't make any sense to me. The Baba Yaga himself dies from a blind man. <laughs> like, do you hear how that sounds? That sounds crazy, bro. The boogeyman himself. He didn't, his body count is like 5,000. <laughs> his body count is like five, like, bro, like, if you add up all the kills in this, in all, this franchise so far, it's going to be like a spinoff TV show, but that's off the topic. It's been like, 3,000 kills, bro. Like, some crazy shit like that. It had to be like 15,000. I mean, 1,500 kills or something like that. Anyways, this movie is crazy, bro. Go see it, bro. It's worth every dollar. The music alone, the cinematography, the how it's shot, the cinematography, the lighting, the, the atmosphere. They're in New York. They go to Berlin. You know what I'm saying? They're in New York. They go to Berlin. They doing this. They doing that. Action nonstop. It's not boring. It, ever, it never gets boring. Even the dialogue is entertaining. The monologues, the short monologues that some of the actresses and the actors have is very entertaining. Not a lot of them, you know what I'm saying? There's not a lot of monologues in there, but there's just short lines. It's just the dialogue in general is very empowering. Um, very engaging, not empowering. <laughs> I would say very engaging. Um, uh i'm trying to get my thoughts out um i don't know man keanu reeves is kick-ass man he's old i mean he's not old he's he's getting old and he's still like he's he's just a good fucking guy he just seems like a great fucking guy if i'm gonna be quite frank with you he gives i heard he gives away money and shit like that i was watching interviews and they say he gives away money and shit like that good for him w keanu um john wick is just amazing bro. just an amazing franchise like usually Franchises de like deteriorate, like deteriorate, 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 and go downhill with sequels. But this just got better and better with sequels. Um, I would say my least favorite is maybe John Wick Three. Or yeah, I would say John Wick Three is the weak out the the weakest out the bunch, but it's still a good movie. I would still give it like an eight out of a ten, a light seven. Um. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so go watch John Wick. My name is Jamel. Like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. I'm Mel N-I-D. M-E-L-N-I-D. Zero, zero, underscore. Uh, more, more music coming soon. More videos coming soon. Movie reviews. I might talk about the NBA. Never know. I'm not a niche. I am the niche. You never know what'll come out of me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so if you, let me just get this out of the way. If you know Optimus, he makes like gameplay videos and he talks about various topics like over his gameplay. So that's what I'm finna start doing. And I don't even got to show my face. I'm gonna just make commentary videos on topics, uh, like hot topics. I'm gonna just make commentary videos. Maybe I might do some story times and shit like that. Oh, man, I just came with an IVD at story times. Holy shit, man. I got to do fucking story times, bro. I just been through a lot of shit, man. Um, yeah, man. All right, this is John Wick uh, interview. I say interview. This is John Wick review. Um, great movie. I will give it, uh, I will give it a nine for sure like bro this movie is gas bro this movie is this movie is gas bro this shit is fucking gas it's nowhere near mid bro 
Oh, let's talk about him being overpowered. He's not really overpowered in this movie. And at the end, another spoiler, he gets shot. Oh, yeah, never mind. He died. <laughs> he died, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was walking, and he stayed alive for so long. That was why I was wondering, like, is he going to die? Like, I've seen, I've seen it coming, bro. Oh, yeah, this other new character, this black guy with the dog. Um, I don't know. He's he's not really that memorable. Uh, just like the afterthought. Um... But yeah, man, shout out Jeremy John, shout out uh, Chris Stuckman, shout out 3C Films, man, they really inspired me to start making movie reviews. I love movies, I love TV shows, so I'm like, why not just like review ones that I really like or like specific ones. Um, I watch Power, I watch BMF, I watch, I watch Power, I watch Star Wars and all that. So let me know if y'all want a Mandalorian review. Um, this season is ass so far. Let me know if y'all want The Last of Us review. I watched The Last of Us. You know what I'm saying? Nobody's telling me to do stuff. So I'm really just doing this shit. What I want to do. You know what I'm saying? I could re be reviewing South Park. They got a new season out. I'm just lazy. I try to not be too hard on myself. I just try to conduct, like, do, like, certain content. Like, write it down. Then do it. Conquer it. And then do it. But, like, I ain't trying to do a whole bunch of stuff. Spread it out. And then I ain't going to end up doing none of that. And then I'm going to just get mad and then i'm just not gonna do none of it <laughs> you know what i'm saying but yeah i'm ranting bro john wick 4 is a great movie like i'm subscribed follow me on instagram mail and id man i'm out of this motherfucker ah uh, bitch oh wait 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 bitch <laughs>